<laughs> you know my people. They say Wahala refused to finish. Wahala for this life refused to finish. You know, for this life all day, <laughs> some people we call themselves say Nigerians. As you see them, the challenge when they get, they eat them up. Challenge won't buy them. They not go focus on their own challenge, which is the problem we won't buy them. They will not focus on it. The thing when they go focus on, when be waiting, they bother them for their life. Now the problem when another person gets. And this very person, when they put their own problem on their head, when you weigh the person challenge, is even lesser than that of theirs. But this category of people, so eh, they will just they go abandon their own. They will focus their eyes on people's problem. Imagine woman will never marry. Let me just say this for this life, somebody can't love you more than you love yourself. A woman will don't wish to marry. We never marry. So you think, say, now you, when they see the woman for distance, now they feel her past this woman, or a lady, when you don't wish to marry, she say you don't ripe, but husband never come. You, when they are far, they see her. Now you come bother past this woman, when you don't ripe, wish to marry, we never marry. You know, there are some times, eh, when you start telling these people, ah, when you won't marry, your age don't define. It's like reminding them of their problem. A lot of people don't like this. But these foolish people, so they always say that they do this person good. Those people, when you say, they're not even exposed for life. They are not just to open their mouth, wow, to talk nonsense. Those people, they're the dangerous people. Because the, their mentality... The way that they reason, their brain. At times, when I look at the way those people reason, I'll just say, wait, now God create this kind of person. How you go to disturb your fellow woman, say, your age don't reach to marry. Do make you go marry. And this person, when they disturb this fellow woman, say, your age don't reach to marry, go marry. If you look the marriage way day, you yourself will never marry. You not go even want to go marry. You just say, if not so marriage, they be no need for me to go inside. But now this saying, I'm a young person. Now you go, they come, they come disturb a fellow woman when husband never come true for. You they disturb her, your age, that a girl, you that a other, you not be small picking again, no, waiting you they wait for. This, please, can people tell this very Particular set of people that are doing all these things that they should mind their business. Look, for this life, everybody gets one challenge to the other when they pursue. At least, I'm not saying it's wrong to say all these things, but how can you just see somebody? Because, say, you know the person from far. The person pass where you day. Even if the both of you are friends, even if you not be friends, there is a way you will even tell that person, say, ah, your age don't they go, do make you go marry. The person will feel offended. Not to talk or say, we'll not be friends. We'll not just they greet each other, hello, hello. You go, they disturb the peace of human being. And this very person, when they disturb people so, when you look in life, ah, God, can people ever mind their business and stop telling people to go and marry? And there are some particular set of people also. They go see fellow woman with their husband house. Because say the woman not born children. Full grand. Like dog fowl. Children when they're born full grand, when they're not take care of. When you even look the children self, to even born plenty children self will irritate you. You know go want. All those kind of set of people, because they're born children, full grand. When they're not they fit take care of the children, they look so tattered and one kind. These same people with their dirty life, they will come, they disturb people with no bone plenty. Maybe some people might just they, they might decide to just have a, a one picking or two. I extreme. But those category of people with bone like eight, 
Now they go carry their dirty life. They can't tell those ones who are born children according to their pockets. They call the time they say, ah, what till you they wait for? This is your became done grow. What till you they wait for? May you do, may you born follow her. Now to born full grand, may they not feel take care of nine be the thing. For me, no. There are some people, number of children will all produce on this life. Now the number of children when their feet take care of without begging anybody for help. But this same set of people will go born full grand like dog fowl. When they not feel take care of the children, when you even look at those picking safe, to bone plenty no go hungry you. Now then I go come leave their problem. When their life not fit, that is they will come they go poke nose for people's life. Ah, what are you waiting for? This your picking don't grow. You no go do me, you bone follow them. Can you ever mind your business? And you don't even know if the woman they pray to God, may God bless her with another one. Doing all these things is like reminding people of their problem. Can you please stop? Then there are not that sex when you say they don't already marry. Maybe one year, two years, three years, four years, five years, six years, ten years, fifteen years, all those things. They never see picking born. So you tell me, you want to tell me, say now you feel the pain past those people when you will be disturbing them. Uh, waiting you they wait now. Waiting you they wait now. What thing concerns you? Saying all these things to this kind of category of people is like reminding them of their challenge. You they kill them inwardly. You don't know the kind of harm where you they cause for inside their body. In your present, they can smile, but when they go to their closets, they, they wet their pillows. Can you people stop? Please stop. You are not helping at all. Mind your business. Everybody gets no problem for life. Stop, overlook your own, then focus your life, your head, your thought on other people's challenge. Mind your business. And when you look at the kind of person when they won't even advise person, say, eh, what are you waiting for? Or uh, your picking don't grow, or when you want to marry, or all those things. When you look at their life, you go spit through it. Nothing good to write home about their life. They are so dumb. Very, very dumb. But now these people go leave their challenge. They can't, they can't disturb people mental health because they cannot mind their business. Mind your business. Advisors, go and remove the speck with they your eyes first. Before you go think of how to remove the speck when they other people's eyes. Go and solve your problem before thinking of solving other people's problem. And in some cases, when you poke nose on people's problem like this, it's like reminding them of their problems. Stop it. Mind your business. Go and solve your own problem. Let everybody solve their problem. Stop reminding people of their pains. Stop it. It's not a good thing. With your blockhead, you think say maybe you are doing the right thing, but you are not doing the right thing. You are causing more pains to those people. Stop it, advisor. Stop it.